Child uh, survival is about giving every family, every mother, a chance to come home at the end of a long day and have the pleasure of interacting with their child. The survival of the child is like the survival of the community. Since the beginning of this century, we've managed to make incredible strides in reducing child mortality, but we've only gotten halfway. And with COVID, things started going backward. The world is losing an entire generation by allowing children to continue to die of pneumonia, malaria, and diarrhea. And you also realize, for us in Africa, it is extremely important because it is also tied to socioeconomic development. It is, first and foremost, a human rights issue. Secondly, it's a moral and ethical issue. We have the evidence that shows which interventions save lives. And together, we have the technical expertise. We have um, the resources. And most of all, we have the commitment to end these preventable deaths. The time is now. Because we know that the rate of deaths at the level of children is very elevated. Or it's the deaths are inevitable. While it's ambitious, it is doable. It is urgent for all of us, country governments in the lead, partners, communities, civil society, and the private sector, really to come together and to accelerate progress. Uh, it's not just about the numbers of five million children dying, but each one of them is a, is a precious child and we want to do all that we can. C'est important parce que c'est le futur de l'humanité. Nous sommes aujourd'hui euh, à un tournant important euh, parce que la majorité de, de la population sur la Terre devient de plus en plus jeune. Alors si on ne prend pas soin de nos petits-enfants, comment ils vont devenir ces jeunes-là pour bat, continuer à bâtir le monde